Hey everybody, Crypto Mentor 99 How you doing? So I've been getting a lot of emails, six or seven, is that a lot? It's a lot for me. Um, on my Wyoming slash crypto free LLC videos. So I think what I'm going to do is I want to leave like a trail, like a video trail, like breadcrumbs, like a breadcrumb trail um, and not do, you know, Wyoming LLC crypto tax free videos every day. But I want to leave um, in the months, the years and decades to come, if YouTube is still around, what I'm finding out on my own personal journey that I want to share with you for free about this whole Wyoming thing. So I found yet another article last night and it's from September 18th, 2019. So it's from this year, but it's not like it's new information. But what I find fascinating is that in the Litecoins or at the Litecoin summit of the video that I did with Caitlin Long, she mentioned, because I was taking notes, and I specifically remember her saying she talked about um and on the video I didn't know what she was referring to. And then I read this article, I'm like, oh, I got it. So the second paragraph of this article says, lawmakers are currently working to refine the law passed in 19, sorry, in 2019 that allows for special purpose depository institutions in Wyoming. Those were the words that Caitlin Long used in Vegas at the Litecoin Summit. Um, so basically, well, let me just finish the sentence. So um, that allows for special purpose depository institutions in Wyoming, a national first that has put Wyoming on the map for underserved financial markets like cryptocurrency, blockchain, coal, paycheck lending, and firearms. So basically, not financial advice, and I am not a lawyer. Basically, Wyoming passed, well, I did a video last night, like 13 cryptocurrency laws that Wyoming has passed and why it's good for us. But these special purpose depository institutions in Wyoming, those are going to be the cryptocurrency banks in the future. Um, and I've actually reached out to Caitlin Long for an interview or some more information. I have yet to hear from her. That was about two or three days ago. But of course, almost every article that you read about Wyoming and cryptocurrency, Caitlin Long is quoted um, in the article, and she is quoted um, in this one. Um, Long is a University of Wyoming and Harvard graduate who staked a claim in the blockchain industry through her former New York business. But she recently moved back to Laramie to help develop a welcoming atmosphere for the young crypto industry in a state badly in need of economic diversification as coal falters and other energy sectors remain uncertain. Uh, if you're interested, take a look at this article. I don't want to say it's a must read, but it's about five blockchain banks that will soon be opening in Wyoming. Anyhow, Crypto Mentor 99, let me know what you think. And uh, yeah, love y'all. See you later. Bye-bye.